What is up YouTube? It is the Villa Outdoors here. Today is June 7th of 2021. I am here at the Bradenton Beach um, Pier down in Anna Maria Island, Florida. We're going to be doing a little bit of multi-species fishing today. Right now we're starting off with a um, size 8 or 12 hook. I'm not really sure what size it is. I believe it's a size 8 hook. And we're going to be trying to catch anything that'll bite right now we got a couple little pieces of squid on there oh i just had our first bite of the day did we lose it yes we did not really sure what that was felt stronger than a pinfish would we're targeting these little pilings here this fish will hang around these structure more than anything else Well guys, there we go. We got our first fish of the day, and it is a big old pinfish. It's probably one of the bigger pinfish I've caught. Much bigger than the one I caught yesterday. Yesterday I was just doing a little bit of um, dock fishing out back of the resort where I'm staying at. And the pinfish I caught there was like an inch long. That is a much prettier looking pinfish than the one I caught yesterday. All right, guys, just released our pinfish. Time to get back in there with another one. Hopefully a little snapper or something else this time. With fishing like shrimp and squid and stuff like that, it's really a guessing game on what's gonna take your bait here in Florida. Guys, we got something a little bit nicer here. Let's get them up. Oh boy, that is a big old pig fish. Hopefully my camera is recording for that. Are we recording? Yes, we are. Look at that guys, second species of the trip. We got a nice sized pig fish here. He uh, got the hook there pretty good. So we're gonna have to do some surgery on them, but that is our second fish of this trip. All right guys, time to let our little pig fish go. We're just gonna go on and drop them back in. Another pin fish. Gotta watch the spines on these guys. He is ready. He wasn't gonna live anyway. That one got him. The book got him in the wrong spot. Alright guys, finally caught on yet another new species. It's been about an hour messing around with a live pinfish. Um, on the other rod, but we got ourselves a little mangrove snapper, third species of the trip. Let's go ahead and take a shot and I'll hook this guy. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and let our little snapper go here. Just gonna slide on back down. That one came on a little piece of squid with the egg sinker about 12 inches above it. Guess there's something on here. Not sure what it is yet. Might just be another pinfish, might be something else. Oh, and we got our first sea catfish of the trip. This is a hardhead catfish. You gotta watch the spines on these guys. He's gonna tangle us all up before he settles down. There we go. First catfish of the trip. Nice hard head catfish. All right guys, well we got a decent fish on here. I'm gonna have to guess it's catfish, but we'll find out when it gets up to the bank. Just doing some bottom fishing with some squid. It's got a little bit of weight to it, pulling just a little bit. He's gonna get tangled up with another rod. Putting up a decent fight. 
Let's see what we got here. He's putting up a good fit fight. That's definitely a catfish. And up he comes. Oh, this is actually a new species for us. We got a sail cat here. Little guy. You gotta get the pliers for this guy because this guy's got a nasty stinger on him. Alright guys, today we are here at the Anna Maria Island City Pier. We we're trying to do some fishing for some Spanish mackerel. I've had a few follow me in on this silver spoon I'm using here. But uh that's been about it. I had a few bumps on the on the gold spoon. No real takes. Um, and the past three casts I've been followed in on the silver spoon. They come out of nowhere. So I'm gonna see if I can get one here. They're killing them on live bait right next to me, but I don't got any live bait. So therefore we cannot use live bait. Guys, we got fish on here. Let's flip them up. All right. First Spanish mackerel of the day here. Gotta handle them properly. There we go. Beautiful looking fish. Gonna need the pliers to unhook this guy because they got some vicious teeth. You don't want to get hooked by those things. There we go. First Spanish mackerel of the trip. This is good. Spanish mackerel. Yep. Alright, nice, easy unhooking. He's good to go. He wasn't hooked too good, so he didn't need the pliers for him. The line's still good, not too many rips. So we're good to go. Good fight those fish put up. <sighs> Just had another fish on. He spit the hook though. I'd rather him do that than break me off. There we go, guys. Yep. Spanish mackerel. Just got our second fish of the day here. Another nice Spanish mackerel on the uh, spoon. Definitely gonna need to get the pliers out for this guy. There we go, guys. Fish is released. We're just gonna send that down. Oh, don't die on me. There you go. Swamp. Very good. Good. All right, number two for the day. Another pinfish. I really thought that was going to be something else. There we go guys, we finally caught something different here. We got a little Atlantic spade fish on the shrimp. Let's take a shot of this guy and let's let him go. All right guys, let's go ahead and let our little, tiny little spade fish go. Took a tiny little chunk of shrimp. Pretty little fish, almost angel fish looking. Just gonna go ahead and drop him back here. There we go guys, another little spade fish on the shrimp. Pretty little fella. Better than pinfish, I'll tell you that. There's a whole school of them down there. Another little spade fish. There you go, guys. 